okay so moving on to problem b raspberries uh this is also a kind like it's a simple problem you're given integers a1 to a and you're given a number k and you have to focus on this constraint because k is at a particular range from 2 to 5 out of like in that range three numbers are actually prime numbers and in one operation you can just select an index i and you can increase the number by like you can increment the number by one find the minimum operations needed to make the product of all the numbers divisible by k so like there's not much over here because see in this range like the k we have over here you have 2 3 4 5 out of this 2 3 and 5 are actually prime numbers so whatever product you have like whatever n numbers you have uh, so let's just say a1 a2 a3 a4 a5 whatever numbers you have if this uh, if you say that this is divisible by 2 that means one of the numbers is divisible by 2 similarly for 3 similarly like for 5 these are prime numbers so that constraint you will have to satisfy so how do we handle this case for 4 you understood for 2 3 5 right because you have to check uh, first the simple check you have to make are any of these numbers divisible by that particular k if yes then simply print 0 and return otherwise just check for 2 3 5 only these are the prime numbers for 2 3 5 check um, I want to make one of these numbers divisible by 2 3 or 5 like whatever k you have in that particular test case and this check uh, how much operations are needed to make like what is the minimum number of operation needed to make any one of these numbers divisible by the given k that that is a simple check for 2 3 and 5 now for 4 again simple check uh, but for 4 there can be an issue for suppose you have 1 and 1 and you compare it with 4 so if you say that uh, I want to make a number divisible by 4 in one of these so that means converting one of these to 4 that's the only option you have right so that actually took 3 operations that actually took 3 operations but the other solve you have was you can actually convert so what we did here we converted 1 1 we converted 1 1 to 1 4 which uh, cost us 3 operations other option you have is you can convert this to 2 2 and this will only take you 2 operations so this case you have to handle and what like and like how do you handle this you have the first case that you have like that you want to handle is you want to convert any one number to be divisible by 4 that's the simple check here and and over there you will get the answer as 3 the case 2 that you have to handle is what if I make two numbers divisible by 2 that will also get the product divisible by 4 right so you can uh, store the diffs so how, so so what do you mean by diffs you can basically store a1 like how li like how many increments you have to make to a1 so that it is divisible by 2 similarly for a2 a3 a4 a5 you will store that in a vector sort it and then actually you will get the minimum two of like the minimum uh, indexes minimum two indexes for which you can increment them and you can get it divisible by 2 uh, for, so for example if I make the diff for this 1 1 the diff for this would also be 1 1 what does this mean you want to increment okay so let's just make this a bit uh, different so suppose this is 3 and uh, 8 so the diff for this would be 1 and 0 what does this mean you need to increment the index 0 position by 1 to make it divisible by 2 and you have to increment this by 0 to make it divisible by 2 so I do this thing and in the end I would get the minimum two numbers that need the least increments to be like to be divisible by 2 so yeah uh, that was it for this so this is the general check if any of the numbers are divisible by the k then you simply print a 0 and you return otherwise if it's k 2 3 or 5 you simply check what's the minimum number of operation I've, and this is like I won't explain this this is simple uh, basically this is so if you don't know you can actually calculate el by k ka seal by el plus k minus 1 by k you don't have to use the seal keyword so this actually gives el by k ka seal so suppose i want to calculate um, 2 by 5 ka so, so no 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 not 2 by 5 i want to calculate 13 by 5 ka seal so if you do 13 by 5 you will actually get 2 right so i but like but i want the seal so what you do is 13 plus 5 minus 1 like which is 17 by 5 that will give you 3 so you need the seal you need the later number right after that particular element so that's why you need the seal and divide it by k and then you find the difference and you simply uh, 
print that because this is 2, 3 and 5 but in case of 4 you will first find that minimum number but you won't print that because the second part that we have to solve is what if I can convert two numbers to be divisible by 2 and that might cost us uh, less operations and then you sort it and then you get the initial two tips it can be 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1 it's up to you and then you simply print that like whatever is the minimum value like whether it was easy to make a number divisible by 4 or was it easy to make two numbers divisible by 2 it's up to you and that case you have to separately handle for 4 so again that's it I'll share the uh, like I share the code in the description you can take it from there I'll solve C and D even by tonight so you can expect the tutorial by that time yeah thank you